In this video, I'm going to show you a new update that SO released not too long ago, and the update is about a new set of APIs. Now, I know if you're not a developer, you're probably thinking this is not for you, but probably it is, and I will explain. There are some things that can be done during the SO interface, and some things will need to be done using a third party integration, and sometimes Maybe you want to create a new portal for your clients, and this portal from your website will need to communicate back to Zoho CRM. Or sometimes you like to have in Zoho CRM some functionality, and this functionality is restricted because the API set was restricted. So even if you want to do some things in Zoho CRM, sometimes we are using as developers, we are using Deluge scripting and the Deluge scripting is using the internal APIs that Zoho releasing to us. So Zoho released a new set of APIs. This is version six. In the next few months, Zoho are going to release an update that version one, two, and three, which those are very old API sets, those are going to basically die and number four, five, and six are replacing the old ones. For number six, there are lots and lots of updates, very nice things. Uh, you are able, for example, to merge records. That was something that was not available before. Let's assume that a new lead comes in. We can run a search. We can see if there is an existing client with the same name, email and phone number. And if it is, we're going automatically to merge the records, right? I got your attention, I guess. So great things can happen with great functionality. And Zoho just released that, and this is awesome. In addition to that, you will have lots of more functionality, even on a level that you can select and manipulate different pick list values and edit them. So you will have the ability using APIs to go all the way down to, let's say, global set pick list and you can manipulate those values. Bottom line, I will drop the link of the APIs in the description below. If you are a developer, probably you want to take advantage of those APIs and give your clients lots of value. If you are a client or a consumer, you probably want to share it with your developers. Are developers making use of those APIs and helping clients achieve new functionality and do crazy things? I recommend you sharing it with your developers if they are not aware of that. And obviously, let them take your business to the next level.